Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Jen's Junk. My name is Jen, and I have an exciting video for you that I've been planning for a while now. This video is going to be my Target haul from their release of some Galaxy's Edge merchandise. Now this happened back in late August, early September, and I actually made two trips because the first time I went, my local Target did not have all the merchandise. Um, so I actually made two trips to see what they all had, and today I'm gonna show you what I picked up from then. So we're gonna get right into it. The first item I'm going to show you is a pack of um, playing cards and this is the Mandalorian so I had to pick this up so not exclusively Galaxy's Edge but they did have them there so I picked them up anyway because it's the Mandalorian and the child so this is just a, a regular pack of playing cards and I'm just going to show you I took some of the cards out so you can kind of see oh my gosh that one's adorable oh so you can see they've got the Mandalorian and the child printed on some of the cards and they are just super adorable. So of course I had to pick those up. Um, I don't normally play cards, so I'll probably use them for display purposes. Um, but of course it had the Mandalorian and the child on it, so I was going to get them anyway. This next um, item I'm gonna show you is also some playing cards. Um, Sabacc. Um, so you hear about this in the Star Wars movies. Um, in Solo, you actually get to see Han Solo playing Lando Calrissian um, in a game of Sabacc. So I did pick that up. So this is what the box looks like. And I'll show you the back here. And I did pull some of the cards out. So this is what the front of the card looks like. And then on the back, you've got some regular playing cards here. So just very cool, very different. Um, Sabacc, you know, you hear about that all the time in the Star Wars universe. So of course I picked those up as well. Just, just a little bit of fun. So pick those up. Um, this ne these next two items I'm gonna show you are actually books. Um, and this first one, I'm really, really excited to read. This is Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Black Spire um, by Delilah Dawson. And this book has been on my reading list for quite a while now. Um, so I'm really anxious to kind of get into and dive into this one since Galaxy's Edge is inspired by the book. And I just haven't really had time yet to go through it. Um, so I'm really, really putting this on my to-do list. Um, I, I just have been so excited to, to get to this book. Um, and I was hoping to get to Galaxy's Edge this year um, during the um, Star Wars celebration in Anaheim. And unfortunately that did not happen this year. So I have not been to Galaxy's Edge yet. Um, it's on my bucket list. It's something that I really, really want to do. And I see tons of people posting videos and pictures from it. and. I just would be so in love being there. I just I just know it. So I, I can't wait to get my taste of it um, through this book. I also picked up another book, um, The Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Traveler's Guide to Batu. I hope I'm pronouncing that right. Um, and in here, it just looks really cool, talking about the Black Spire Outpost. Um, so it has some pictures here. Um, food, not alcoholic, <laughs> so just very cool, around the galaxy, um, and it has some transportation for those around the galaxy, so just really cool, this looks like a really cool book, so I picked it up, um, and again, just kind of inspired to learn more about Galaxy's Edge, because I really, really want to go so badly, so badly I want to go. You guys have no idea. Um, so anyway, I picked up those two books, which is fun. Um, this next item I'm going to show you was just super duper cute. And again, it's not really related to Galaxy's Edge. However, they did have it in the store, so I picked it up. It is Lego Plushy the Child. Look at that. How adorable. I just couldn't 
pass it up. <laughs> Look at his ears. Oh my gosh, I just can't get enough of his ears. <laughs> Here's the back. So again, you've got the Lego um, plushie, so it's in the shape. Oh, the hands are actually kind of um, a little bit more stiff than the rest of the body. So the body is kind of more plush, um, and then the hands are a little bit, a little bit tougher exterior there. I didn't notice that before. Um, but how cute, how cute is he? So of course I had to pick him up, and not really related to Galaxy's Edge, but. I had to buy it anyway. All right, these next few items are pop related. Um, now these I, I'm not familiar with because I have not been to Galaxy's Edge and I haven't read the book. I don't know if it's in the book or not, but it was Galaxy's Edge, so I just grabbed what I could. A lot of it was gone or not even there. So I did pick up this one, CB6B, um, which is a very cool, kind of an orange, color you can kind of see on the side and again because i haven't been to galaxy's edge i really don't know anything about um some of the the names <laughs> so anyway i just picked it up because it was there and it was um galaxy's edge so i picked that one up the other one i picked up was m5 r3 um, so very cool detail on this one with the red. I don't know if my camera is picking that up. So here is the side. Here's the back. And I wish I knew more about them. I just, I just don't at this point. I just kind of grabbed whatever I could get my hands on. Um, so those were two of the bigger pops that I, that I got. And then we have these um, smaller ones. Uh, so Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Trading Outpost. Um, and here it says, transported from Star Wars Galaxy's Edge Trading Outpost. So here is the first droid. It's kind of orange and black. And here is the side. Back. So that's the packaging. The packaging is, is kind of different. I'll show you from the top there. So that was kind of cool. And then the other one, um, this is a double. Um, and again, it says, transported from Star Wars Galaxy's Edge, trading outpost, BB units. Um, so here are two. One looks like it's red orangish and one is kind of a black colored. Hopefully my camera's picking that up. So there's the front. And then here we've got this side. So these are just BB-8, B, not BB-8, BB units. <laughs> it's just automatic when you say BB, you just say BB-8 right after it. So, so BB units for this one. So those were adorable and cute. So I picked those up. Um, and this next item, this is actually my last item that I'm going to show you is probably my favorite and it's super adorable. You guys, look, it's Jabba the Hutt and Salacious Crumb. Look how adorable this mug is, you guys. Look, and then here's the handle. And then here's the back of it and the inside. So there's really not a lot of space, <laughs> but look how adorable they made Jabba. I didn't know that you could make Jabba look adorable like this with salacious crumb. I mean, it's just, I almost bought two, <laughs> but they only had three. Um, they only had three at the store, so I felt kind of bad taking another one and leaving just one. So I, I bought just one item for myself. So, but it was just super adorable. I probably should have gotten two, but I just didn't. I wanted to leave some for some other Star Wars fans <laughs> there and not take everything. Um, but just super adorable. Just kind of like, this is a, kind of like a stitch detail around here. And it's just so, so cute. And then you got Salacious Crumb. 
Just adorable, just adorable. Such an adorable mug. So that is probably my favorite item out of my Galaxy's Edge haul from Target um, at the end of August, early September. It feels so long ago. I don't know why it feels that long ago. So um, let me know in the comments below what was your favorite item that I picked up from Target um, with the release of their Galaxy's Edge merchandise. Um, did you go to the release? What did you guys all pick up from Target's release of the Galaxy's Edge merchandise. Let me know in the comments below. And um, just again, just curious what you guys, what you guys got, what you guys like, what items were your favorite. Um, have you been to Galaxy's Edge at the parks? Um, what was your favorite thing about it? And I just, I wish I, I wish I could go. So it's definitely on my bucket list whenever it's safe to travel again. I'm saving up my money so I can go. Um, so I just, I have a feeling that it would be my, my happy, happy, happy place. <laughs> so I can't wait for that to, to eventually happen. So let me know with your experience with Galaxy's Edge in the comments below. As always, thank you for taking the time to watch this video. If you are up for some more Star Wars fun, please consider following me on Twitter and on Instagram. That information is on my about page. And also, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. And also consider subscribing as well. Thanks again for watching, you guys. Until next time, may the force be with you.